don't be scared. I know I look like a hot mess, but it's okay. I look so pale. My hair's not straightened at all, but I'm literally just out the shower. Well, not just out the shower, that's a lie. Literally took my dog out and everything. This is what my natural hair looks like when it dries. Uh, horrible, isn't it? So I'm looking super pale, but that's because today's video is going to be a tan video. Might notice something. Oh, who is she? Better quality. Yes, I got my light. I finally got my light. Firstly, if you're watching this, subscribe, like this video. I've decided, usually I do shout outs at the end of my video, but I've decided I'm gonna switch it up just cause it's a new year and I've decided to switch everything up. What I'm gonna be doing is I'm gonna be doing a shout out at the end of all my videos, but like one shout out. It's gonna be like a comment shout out. You can write whatever you want in the comments. If you want like a TikTok shout out or whatever like that, you can leave your TikTok name obviously in the comment that you put. I'll just pick one at random and I'll put it at the start of my video. In today's video, we're gonna be testing this tan. But risky because I mean, I've never heard anything about this tan before in my life. I've never heard anyone talk about it. I've never seen it in my life. I literally just walked into Super Rug and I seen it and I was like, oh, that looks interesting. I want to try you. Never heard anything about it. So I thought I'd make a video on it because like, yeah, I don't know if anyone else has made a review on it. I don't know, not like that. This is the Skinny Tan Chocolate Tan and it's called Dark Chocolate. It's a self tanning whip. That is risky because I might go green. My Gopache. Who knows? We'll find out together. <laughs> but I'm excited to try it. There was only like, three reviews on the Superdog website. I think it's chocolate scented. And I mean, some people are fond of chocolate scent, some people aren't. I don't really know if I am or if I am not. We will find out, won't we? So let's just get into the video and let's hope I don't go green. So just for reference, I've used a lot of different hands. Like, my favourite ones are the St. Moritz Dark, because the Ultra Dark made me go green, or Bondi Sands Ultra Dark. Now, when I do tan, I like to go all or nothing. So I like my tan to be dark because I'm just used to, I started off with light, medium, Bondi Sands, and I thought, oh, that's too light. I went dark, then I went ultra dark. So yeah, that's the one that I like to use. That's kind of what I'm going to be comparing it to. I've tried a lot, a lot of tans, so many. Saint Tropez Extra Dark, is really good as well. So they're all the three that my favourite ones that I like to use. So that's kind of what I'll be comparing it to. I already shaved, like exfoliated stuff in the shower. So let's see. I've got my Bondi Sands mat here. I don't have a tripod yet. I know I've got my light, but not a tripod. I'm sorry if you're a wee bit low. I've not even made like one scoosh of this yet. So I literally do not know what colour it is. But this is the bottle. I really want to try the Molly May tan. So let me know if you want me to try that. I always put like my camera at this angle and I look like I'm pure like a giant or something like that. Ooh! It's like, it's kind of like the, it's kind of like a whip. So it's kind of reminding me of the Coca Brown tan, but I don't really like this tan because I think it comes off too easily and it's not dark enough. It has a very faint chocolatey smell. It's not really like, <gasps> look at all that foam. But it's given me like plenty of time to like move around with it, like it's not staying like in the one place or anything like that. But off camera to do like the rest of my chest and like my back. But I'll come back to you once I've done one leg so we can like see a comparison. Okay, so I'm one of the people that always tans their face. It's like having tan on my face because when I wake my makeup off then it's still kind of my skin still looks good, like nice and tanned. I know a lot of people don't tan their face because their skin, like it makes them break out and stuff like that, but I've got like really good skin. I've got like really good skin. I don't ever get spots. Not like saying that as if like, oh, I don't ever get spots. I'm just saying like, that's why I tan my face because I know a lot of people don't. For comparison for my legs, it's kind of like, comparison. Now, keeping in mind it will develop within like six to eight hours. I usually keep mine on overnight, but it's only like five o'clock now. So 
I might wash it off at about 12. I've found with this tan, I don't actually need to use as much as like my St. Moritz and Bondi Sands because it is like a foam, so like one pump like swells right up. I'll probably put in another coat in about 20 minutes, half an hour, just because I like it to be as dark as I can. I don't know how this is going to be developing, but right now it's like not that dark. Like it's okay, but it's not that dark, but obviously you can't judge a tan by like the first shade that you put it on. Also, another big test is how it's going to look when I wash it off because I've had tans before where they look amazing and I go in the shower and then completely gone. This is like one leg with the tan. This is like the other. I'm going to do my other leg and I'll come back to you when I'm putting my second coat. Look at that second coat. I still think it's so pale but it might just be this light. My legs look quite nice but I like darker so fingers crossed that it goes much, much darker as it develops. Okay, not gonna lie, I've just put on my second coat and I'm literally obsessed with this colour. Like, see if it even stays that colour. Like, obviously it's gonna develop. It's got eight hours to develop, so I'm excited. But see that colour? That is beautiful. Like, see, I really hope that it kind of stays, like, look at that! Like, this kind of shade. I love it so much, like it applies beautifully. Actually, look at that! How beautiful. So I really hope like when it washes off, it stays, even if it goes this colour, like I know it's got a long time to develop and get darker, but even if it stays this colour when it washes off, I will be happy because that's like sitting when it's dark when it's washed off. So I'm super excited to see like the colour it turns out when it develops because I'm obsessed. I'll leave a link to this tan in the description box if you want to buy. Okay, so I've washed it off and all I can say is wow. Like, wow. It's literally like so smooth, right? Most of the colour actually stayed on. As you can see, my legs look absolutely great. Ah, but I can, I think I found a new favourite tan. Literally, this is the tan that's, it looks so good. Like, such a nice colour, it's not too dark, not green at all for a start, considering the amount of time I left it on. It's just like such a nice, beautiful colour and it's so smooth, it's not patchy whatsoever. Like, I freaking love this. I'm definitely going to leave this in the description box. Now, obviously keep in mind, I don't know how long this tan's going to last and how it's going to wear off, whether it's going to go like tiger bread or it's just going to fade. So. I'll put in the description box, obviously, not right now, I can't when I upload this, but when I've worn it for however long, I'll put in the description box how long it actually lasted and stuff like that. If you hear any chewing in the background, it's my dog chewing his bone. But there was only one bottle of this left in Superdrug, there was only two, I bought one and there was another one. I'm literally buying it today. Like, I'm going and I'm buying that. I'm stocking up on this stuff because I love this so much. That concludes my video. Please give this a thumbs up. If you enjoyed, let me know down in the comments if you want me to review the Molly May one because I really want to buy it. Um, let me know if you've ever tried it. Subscribe and I'll see you in my next video.